ventured out for the day. I am not doing what I set out to do today. Had a rough start to the morning. This to say, <laughs> my stomach wasn't happy with me, so it kept me inside for the most part this morning. But I am on my way out to discover a grocery store, but I figured I'd walk over to the Hudson and take that trip down there. So I'll have you guys follow me as I go along. And also, there's the Statue of Liberty again. I got to the first grocery store really wasn't a grocery store so I am back at Whole Foods and hopefully this time I don't get overwhelmed and get some stuff that I can have in the apartment so follow me in Well, hello guys. Today is Tuesday, January 30th, and today was a little bit of an uneventful day. So I pretty much chilled. I actually spoke to my sister Courtney for a while, and then after I got off the phone with her, it was around 2, 2.30, I decided to take an adventure to a local grocery store about 15 minutes away because I wanted to get like coffee creamer and stuff like that. And walked in there, not impressed, very small store, which I always wondered how they handle that here in the city, but for coffee creamer, it was like $7. So I left them and went to walk back, stopped at the wine store, grabbed myself a Moscato, dropped that off at the apartment, and then I walked back out to Whole Foods. Now I know that I was at Whole Foods on Saturday. However, it was overwhelming due to the amount of people that were in there. And I was just kind of, you know, it was my first time out and I didn't want to spend too much time looking around Whole Foods and stuff. So I didn't get anything while I was there. And another main reason why I went in there was this sandwich that's making waves on the internet I wanted to get. And I just couldn't find where they had that located at the time. And I got a couple of items there that I'm going to show you in a second. But the sandwich is gone because I had it when I came home and ate it for dinner. And let me just tell you that the hype is real. It was very, very good. My only complaint, besides the price, my only complaint for me is cabanera bread. And the breading was too thick for me. So I ended up peeling a lot of the breading off of the top of the sandwich just because it was too thick for me. Uh, so, 
but it was really, really good. So if you were around a Whole Foods, I highly suggest going in to check it out. So with that, I am going to show you what I got from Whole Foods. So come along. Hey guys, so wanted to show my Whole Food haul. Okay, so I know I told you I already ate it, but $8.99 for the Smoky TTLA sandwich. Insert description here. Okay. Tempa, tomato, lettuce, and avocado. Oh, I used that in a text the other yeah. day. And blogger? Her name is Tabitha Brown. She recorded a review of this TTLA sandwich and it's going crazy viral. Now Whole Foods cannot keep them in stock. Mm. Y'all, Lord have mercy. Mm. Wow. And as I said, it was a really good sandwich. I got it without tomato because anybody that knows me knows that I don't like tomato. I also got guac and tortilla chips for a snack whenever I feel the need to snack. I love guacamole and I just needed something on hand just in case I needed a snack. I got, okay, so I got this to have on hand as a heat up. It is their third alarm chili. So not for tonight because I already had my sandwich and I'm full. I also got this because anybody that knows me knows that I love pepper jack cheese. And they actually had, anybody who knows me knows that I like pepper jack cheese. And this is chickpea pasta with pepper jack and red pepper flakes. So I got that as a, you know, like lunch or whatever. It's something to have just to make and heat up if, when the time comes. <sighs> Guys, at the other grocery store that I went to, it was $8.75 for coffee meat. So I got this creamer instead for $4.99 at Whole Foods. And it is pecan caramel flavored because I need creamer with my coffee. I like deals and this was a steal. Do you like how that rhymed? I like deals and this was a steal. Anyhow, uh, <laughs> spice pumpkin truffles from Whole Foods to try. My plan is to take these home with me though. Not for here, but in a vlog that I did in regards to my struggles and my weight, I did talk very briefly about the fact that there are times where I wake up and I need something sweet in order to go back to, to sleep. So I kind of feel guilty for buying these, the next item I'm about to show you, but then I kind of don't because I'm in New York, I'm walking my ass off, and I need sleep. So these are called French Mini Bayonets Chocolate Hazelnut Truffle. They are very tiny. I know it doesn't look like it, but they're they're very tiny. They're, they kind of remind me of those donuts you would get at a Chinese restaurant, except they're filled. So these I have on hand in case I wake up tonight or any other night and need a, a quick snack. So, oh, I also got Ricola's, which is in my purse already. So. I, I've been suffering from dry mouth, so I got Ricola's to help me out when I'm out and about and walking. Oh, and yes, wine. So that is my Whole Foods haul. All right, guys, so now you know what I got from Whole Foods. Just wanted to also tell you guys that I love it here. I do, it's definitely, uh, hmm, let me rephrase that. I think it's difficult to live in a city like this. I lived in Baltimore, bless you, kitty cat is sneezing. I uh, lived in Baltimore, but I lived on the outskirts of Baltimore, so shopping and all that kind of stuff was way easier than city living like this, where you know I don't have a car, I have to go to the local grocery stores around me besides just having them delivered, which by the way, I could have had my groceries delivered from Whole Foods it really wasn't that much and I wasn't about to have it delivered for that. It was easy for me to carry. But, just a fun fact, you, you can get pretty much everything delivered here. So, 
So with that, I'm going to sign out. I hope everyone had a fantastic day. I hope you're enjoying the vlogs. Today, again, was low key, but tune in tomorrow to find out what I'm gonna do tomorrow. So with that, take care, have a blessed day. This is to document that I have my own version of Smokey. What? You want food. Napo. What?